Hi, welcome to this course on composing a piece of music from beginning to end. My name is Ben Botkin. I'm a composer for film, video games, or you might know me from uh, sample library demos I've written for a couple different sample library developers. This is an exciting time to be a computer-based composer. The technology and the tools just open up a world of opportunity and possibility that we've never, I don't think we've ever really had to this degree. Basically, the promise of the tools is that you can make something lifelike and musical and compelling and produce it on a computer in your bedroom. Like orchestral music, not just you know, EDM or electronic stuff, but like acoustic sounding orchestral stuff can actually sound pretty good. That's awesome. Now, we've got the tools. Let's say we've got the tools, we've got the software. Maybe you're at a place where you're set up, you've begun with some of your tools, but we still need to know how to write that music and produce that music because it's not going to write itself. And well, you don't want it to. Maybe you've got great ideas to begin with, but you're not exactly sure how to take a 20 second idea and turn it into a three minute piece. Or maybe you play the piano, you know how to you know how to do things on piano great, but you're not exactly sure how to translate that to full orchestra. Or maybe you just don't know how to map something out to a grid in a DAW. Maybe you have a hard time finishing your tracks. You start a lot, but getting them across the finish lines for some reason is just really hard. Or you have questions about mixing or mastering. Or maybe you just want to look over the shoulder of somebody who's been doing it a little bit longer than you have. In any case, if this sounds like where you are, you're somewhere on that beginner to intermediate um, spectrum, and you're just trying to get your music composing and production skills, particularly with orchestral uh, instruments, to the next level, then this might be the course for you. So what I'm going to be doing is I actually write a piece of music. In this case, it's a piece called The Heart of a Hero from beginning to end, and I show you my entire process from concept to composition to structuring it out, plotting it out in the DAW with the tempo track and everything, moving to arrangement, orchestration, voicing, um, shaping the performance, and even fine tuning and, and uh, finishing up with mixing and mastering. Basically, I show my entire process in almost real time. So it's, it's kind of long, but you also, also nothing is skipped. So you can see every single thing that I'm doing, and uh, I try to explain why as well. I mean, I may forget a few things, but that's certainly my intention to say, here's what I'm doing, here's why I'm doing it, here's what I'm doing, here's why I'm doing it, from beginning to end. And because I think one of the best ways to learn is to actually uh, implement what you're learning as you're learning it, I actually strongly encourage all my students to write a piece of music alongside with me. So, you know, in the lesson where I come up with my melody, I teach a little bit about writing melodies and I say, hey, write your own melody. And then in, in the next step where we're structuring it out, I, I do it and I say, okay, now you do it with your piece. And we go step by step. And then that way, when we get to the end of the course, you've not only gotten to the end of the course and hopefully learned a bunch of stuff, but you actually have a piece of music of your own which you've used to, you've implemented everything you've learned into a piece of music, and therefore you've internalized that instruction better. And um, you also have a finished piece of music you can put on your website, you can share with a client, you can share with friends. You have something to show basically for, for your efforts. And so the learning is not just theoretical, it's actually become intensely practical for you and it's turned into something real. And this might even be something that's a kickstart for you. You're like, hey, I do know how to do this. I do know how to make a finish a piece of music. And I've done it. And I can do it again. And I can do it again. And I know a little bit about at least one process for doing it because I've watched this guy Bot can do it. Maybe it's not the best way to write a piece of music, but it is a way. And I know how to do it. So who is this course for? Well, it could be for really anyone who's excited about the possibility of creating music on the computer, but they don't know exactly how to do it. Or at least uh, they're not um, particularly confident or 
they're not composing music at a particularly high level and at a high output yet. So given that, that this course is for kind of the beginner to intermediate level composer, if you're an advanced composer who's already working professionally, uh, is writing tracks systematically, um, you're, you're, you have good mock-up skills with virtual instruments, then you still might get uh, stuff out of it, looking over my shoulder and just seeing my process, but um, you'll probably get less out of it because this course is not really tailored to a composer at that stage of his career. Also, this course has an orchestral emphasis. I mean, I write orchestral music for film, games, etc. That's really my background. That's what I know. And so you should just know from the outset, that's really the focus of the composition and the production. Now, a question I get sometimes is, Ben, how much do I need to know about music to take advantage of this course? Do I have to have taken composition lessons? Do I have to know how to read music? And the answer to that is, uh, well, it's good to get have as much education as, as you can. Um, you know, it's, it's good to keep getting that education. You don't need to have had a lot of formalized training or probably maybe any formalized training to be able to get a lot out of this course. And you don't even need to know how to read sheet music at all because everything I'm doing is in a DAW with MIDI. And you're seeing the dots and dashes on the screen. There's not even a scrap of musical notation in this entire course. In terms of terminology, I keep it fairly basic. So if you know and understand terms like melody, harmony, bass, then you'll probably track with most of what I'm communicating. In this course, just to give you a sampling, I will be covering things like the mindset of the computer-based composer, melody writing basics, structuring and plotting out your piece in your DAW, principles of orchestration and voicing, fleshing out an arrangement, shaping performances, handling dynamics and swells, making orchestration choices, fine-tuning your piece, and different mixing and mastering approaches. You will also get access to the MIDI files for the piece that I create called The Heart of a Hero, which you can then use uh, for further experimentation and further learning. With that said, let's get started.